and a very good day to you all. In this video, I would like to discuss on how to find the sum of an arithmetic sequence, uh, provided that the questions is not uh, as the previous one that we have discussed. Previously, we've seen uh, this kind of question whereby they gave us like uh, um, the first, uh, the fifth term is of four, and then the sum of the first 10 terms is 20 then afterwards we need to find the sum of uh, 100 something like that okay but this time the question is not like that okay the question is as the as you can see on the screen uh, find the sum of all the integers between 0 and 200 that are not divisible by 4 okay so first thing first let's uh, list all the numbers between Okay, um, maybe not numbers, we just integers between 0 and 200. So it starts from 1, 2, 3, and so on until uh, maybe uh, 195, 196, 197, 198, and 199. We cannot take 200 because we want integers between 200 and 0. So the numbers mentioned is not included. So just uh, let's wrap them off. Now, these are all integers between 0 to 200. So uh, the numbers between 0 and 200 is the first condition. And not divisible by 4 is the second uh, rule that we have to follow. So let's um, Maybe we can circle all the numbers. Yeah, so we have this is not divisible. This is not divisible. This is not Proceed this is not divisible. This is not this is not this is not now um, Surprisingly we we after we do the screening and then we get rid of the numbers divisible by 4 we get 1 2 3 uh, 4 cannot and then we have 5 6 7 8 cannot and then we proceed until we get uh, 195 197 198 and 199 okay so these are all the numbers are not divisible by 4 okay i think let me check first. I think 198 is suspiciously divisible by 4. 198 divisible by 4. Let me check. Oh, not really. Hmm. Good, good then. Now, let's see whether this this sequence, uh, this, these numbers, this collection of numbers is a sequence or not. So, maybe we can assume 1 is the A. Eh? And then, uh, maybe we can... Um, Assume that the difference between these two and the difference between these two are the same. So for the sake of comparing, maybe I use different color circle. Okay, now the difference between 2 and 3 is uh, the D is 3 minus 2, so 1. Okay, now let's have a look. The next one, uh, 5 minus 3 is 2. Oh. So as you can see here, the D's are not the same. The, there are no uh, there are no common difference between them. So these these collections of numbers cannot possibly be the sequence that we want. So they they are not following a a, a fixed uh, a cons a consistent uh, rule. Okay, uh, they didn't follow a function for them to generate this kind of number. So hmm, what should we do? Okay. Okay, now, oh, maybe I forgot to label the numbers, eh? Okay, now, so these are the Z, okay, between 0 to 100 and not divisible by 4, okay. So these are all the num uh, integers between 0 and 200 and not divisible by 4. So what should we do? Interestingly, okay, the one that we left out from the first, uh, from the first list here, okay, why don't we take those numbers? Eh? Those numbers are four, okay, because we didn't circle four, right? Four we reject because four is divisible by four, okay. 
and then afterwards a and dot 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 up until you see here we didn't circle them because 196 is the is the number that is divisible by 4 okay so these are the numbers or integers between 0 and 200 and divisible by 4 okay now hmm so this is maybe the a not maybe it is the a because it is the first term in 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 the sequence of numbers okay whether we want to know the these numbers follow uh an arithmetic uh, sequence or geometric sequence maybe we need to find the common difference okay so common difference here is 8 minus 4 so we have 4 over here so 4 8 afterwards is 12 the next number is 12 so let's get 12 and find the common difference yeah so 8 minus 12 is surprisingly 4 so as you can see here the common difference is is a constant it's the same number throughout the list until 196 so um the integers between 0 and 200 and divisible by 4 follows a certain um, arithmetic uh, sequence so we can use this on our advantage to find the uh, the sum all integers between 0 and 200 that are not divisible by 4 uh, but how it is simple okay first we find the sum, the sum of this the sum of the integers between 0 to 200 and then we minus them with this one the one that we can calculate Therefore, the balance is the one that we want. Okay, so maybe I rewrite back. So the sum of 0 to 200, okay, and then we minus them with the sum of 0 to 200 and divisible by 4 is, is the, wait, I move it this way, is the sum of not divisible okay so by using this formula uh, it can help us to proceed now let's find the sum of this okay so let's grab the number okay so for the first one for the first part here this one eh? so the numbers are one two three dot 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 until 199 so 1 is the a okay you see the 2 1 and 3 2 the difference are the same this is different this one the difference also 1 so they are constant now this one is the tn okay but uh, specifically is the t um T199 is the 199th term in the sequence. Okay, so from here we can work out the uh, sum 199. Okay, so 199 over 2, um, the first term plus the last term. Okay, and then um, uh, or when you're done calculating, you will get this. Okay. 9,900 so we we have done with that then next we want to do this one the sum of integer from 0 to 200 and divisible by 4 it is the one that I circle uh, over here so let's bring them down here so the the numbers are 4 8 12 <laughs> dot 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 uh, 196 okay so from for this one this one is the first term the a as you can see the difference between 8 and 4 and the difference between 12 and 8 they are just the same thing therefore the common difference is 4 while 196 is the last term okay the last term but what number okay it is the 
49th term Okay, how to get it? Yeah, it's easy So, Tn equals A plus N minus 1D So, Tn is 196 Okay, so A is 4 plus N minus 1 We don't know D is 4 as well And then uh, 4 plus 4N minus 4 196 N is the these two is 0 and then N is 196 over 4 therefore we get 49 okay now so let's proceed to find the sum of uh, this sequence okay the one that I have circled so it is the 49th sum okay so 49 over 2 okay twice the first uh, first term plus n minus 1 49 minus 1 and the difference common difference is 4 and then 49 over 2 the number is not nice 8 plus 48 multiplied by 4 okay uh, and then uh, when you use your calculator you will find you will get 4900 okay so so the sum of 0 to 200 is 199 while the sum of 0 to 200 and the integers divisible by 4 is 4900 therefore sum of not divisible by 4 okay and also uh, Z 0 until 200 is equals 19900 minus 4900 Therefore you will get you will get 15,000 as your answer So maybe I zoom that out for you to see the whole picture Thank you for your time and attention Assalamualaikum and have a good day